Hi, and welcome back to Grow with the Jam Family. In case you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. subscribe and click that notification bell so you're notified every single time we post a new video. Ding! And we post a new video two or three every single day. <laughs> so welcome to the family if you're new, and if you're not new, we're glad to see you back. And keep sharing with your friends and sending us lots of comments. So we had um, some comments after we did our war trailer yesterday that Har Harthrick was in and somebody was like he's also in this super 30 which had been on our list to do for a while and so today we're gonna do it yeah so let's start it up It's based on a true story. The Super 30 is actually um, a true story about a teacher who took these 30 kids and, you know, taught them, you know, gave them the resources that they wouldn't have had normally. Yeah. Um, which is just amazing. Um, it's so nice to see. I mean, you know, at the beginning they talk about, no, oh, you think India is this third world country, but, um, you know, all these big companies are either based out of India or have Indians running them here in the U.S. Like most of the doctors we see are Indians yeah. and uh, people in the higher up positions um, are usually the smart ones and majority of the time are Indians. So uh, something to be really proud of. But yeah, when you think of India, you think like, you know, like they showed at the beginning, like those poor kids and, and these other kids that he's teaching, like, it's so amazing to see because they wouldn't have had that kind of program, I guess I would say, or somebody to teach them the things that they needed to learn. You know, they look like they had to go work instead of being in school. Yeah. And, um, you know, they didn't look like they had any books or supplies. And, uh, you know, like you said, if everything's on equal ground, if everybody has an equal chance, 
then the best should rise out of that. Yeah, what was your favorite part about this so, movie? I liked how he's like kind of like famous and most famous people like want money, but he doesn't want money. He like just wants to help people live up to the, like their dreams and their um like to live a good life. Yeah. Yeah, he seems like a really great guy. And uh, like you said, like yeah. people that can get more money sometimes get greedy. And you can definitely tell that that's not yeah. him. Like he chooses to do a free service for these children to give them a fighting chance to be great people. That's amazing. Yeah, because even if you're poor, it doesn't mean you're not smart. Exactly. And when you're poor, even here, like, Anjali goes to a really nice school. We live in a nice neighborhood. Um, you know, and they're always saying, like, they, they could use some more supplies. But I know when I grew up in the city and, uh, you know, we didn't have a lot of supplies. And it does make a difference, you know, if you don't have, you know, your school has, like, tablets and, um, you know, computers and, you know, sometimes the kids in the city or, you know, that don't have a great home may not have a meal on their plate and then they don't have a pencil to write with. They, they're not given that equal chance and this guy looks like he's trying to give them that equal chance to fight, to be great people and they look like they will be. So it's amazing. It looks like an awesome movie. Like, and I think it just came out a couple weeks ago. So let us know if you saw it, but this is something Angelia and I are going to go see for mm -hmm. sure. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.